sorry. Okay, so I'm gonna wait for my friends to come on here. We were all at another live stream and just ended abruptly. So <laughs> sorry about that. Um, we were talking about Lion Sleeps Tonight and how to make that one work. Let me see. Share, copy link. Let me send it on Telegram. Okay. I just sent it on our Telegram chat. Thankfully the chat uh, is a great way to communicate. <laughs> Sorry y'all. Okay, so, hi Various Hog, welcome. Hello Calliope, oh Calliope. Fatima, hi, hi Ligia. <laughs> I don't know what happened. We just overloaded YouTube and it quit and I couldn't restart it. Other times when this happens, I'm able to restart, but for some reason today it was like, no, nope, you're done. So don't know what happened. A uh, long time no see, I know. Hey Linda, how are you? I haven't said hi to you. Oh, the other one hasn't ended. That is so weird. That is so weird. Uh, so thank you. I'm back, back again. <laughs> thank you. I'm gonna drop it on the chat. Oh, okay. Drishia already dropped it. Thank you. Sweet. Thank you, Drishia. Everything's fine. Sorry I missed yesterday's lesson. Okay, so let's talk about how to record ourselves. And yeah, let's hit the like button. Is this inception of stream? Yes, I don't know what happened. Okay, so let's talk about how to record our parts. Number one, and please, 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 I cannot stress this enough. If there's only one thing you take away from our session right now talking about how to record, it's this. Please tune before you record, and if you record a different take, tune again. So tune before every recording because over here, the ukulele is forgiven, forgiving. But once we get in, into the high notes, any little discrepancy with tuning is gonna be so um, obvious and it's gonna be unusable. Like once we put all the, the songs together and everyone together, it's gonna be unusable. So yes, it's very important to sound alike, especially on those high notes. Those high are the ones that are gonna make or break it. Okay, so how to record. Um, let me show you different lighting and how to record. I would record with your phone. Record with your phone. For me, it's a lot better if you record horizontally because if, oh, and you don't have to play the whole song. I love that, that's perfect. And Profe, would you be down to edit this together for us? Let me know. Um, <clears throat> if possible um, okay we are recording this song uh, lion sleeps tonight I'd love to record it at let me see what it sounds like at 100 BPM let me play the all ukes track <laughs> Like you could do it at 120. This is 120. Let's raise the light count. Grab 
you're gonna record like this, okay? Record on your phone. You can do it on the selfie camera so you can watch yourself, or if you just get distracted watching yourself, do it on the back camera. Take a test video to make sure you're in the frame, and then uh, watch it. So first things first, framing. Second, like Prof said, you don't need to record the whole song because Prof is going to uh, put different people on the screen at different times. It's not gonna be like just you on the screen the whole time. And so we all need to be on the same tempo. So um, let's try it at 120, let's try. I think you can do it even if you don't do the whole song. If you just do the strumming and that's your part, and that's how you participate, then that's how you participate. Um, but I think you can do it. You, we, we know the song, it's pretty familiar, and it's doable, it's something you can do. The Start practicing with 80, and then in a few days move up to 100, and then in a few days move up to 120. Um, let's start, let's practice again uh, on Monday, and then if you can, send the recordings to BernadetteTeachesMusic at gmail.com. BernadetteTeachesMusic at gmail.com is going to be the place to send the recordings. Okay? And then I'll forward them to Profe. Hi, Patricia. Hi, Punam. So, um, let me talk to you about light. If you're recording in a room like a bedroom or something like that it helps a lot if there's like covers and cushions and all that because that'll eliminate echo now let's say that you don't have good lighting i'm working with fancy lights that's me without the lights on hold on let me turn off all the lights in this room I'm going to teach you how to get good light. Okay. So this would be pretty mediocre light. Will it do for our collaboration video? Of course it will. This is good enough. So record earlier in your day. I talked to the patrons about this not too long ago because we're going to do a Patreon video too. Now, let me teach you a little hack to get nice light. So on your computer, Raise your brightness all the way you can and go to a very white page like Google. Google is a very white page because it has so much white area and increase the brightness all the way. And then what you do is you get close to it and the lighting is better. See that? It's better than it was. Look, I'm going to darken it. Now the screen is dark. But as soon as I brighten the screen, it brightens up my face. Um, now let's say that you don't have something like that or you don't like that option or you wanna see more of the ukulele. I'm gonna... Then what you do is you get close to a window when it doesn't have direct sunlight. Indirect sunlight is best. And boom, good light. That's really good light. So the sun is back here, but it's giving enough light where I'm getting a nice light bounce. Now, a really, really, really nice hack is if, let's say that the window gets direct sunlight, then what you do is you put a white bed sheet over the window. Oh, your lighting will look like my professional lights because this is kind of see-through, kind of like a bed sheet would be. You're gonna look like this. Like you're gonna look like snack. So, um, so lighting will make it look like your camera is better than it is. So lighting is really important. Next, sound. If you have a TV on in the background, even if it's really soft, we can't really use your video because that TV could be playing a music video, could be playing a Netflix special, and the sound detectors on YouTube, because I want to put this on YouTube, are so sensitive that it can pick up on 
you playing something that it has copyright. So if there's a copyright on whatever you're playing, then we can't use your audio because we will, our video will get taken down. So make sure it is quiet. Make sure you don't have anything playing in the background. Now let's pretend that I'm about to record. I'm about to record. It's recording day and I'm gonna do it. <clears throat> I got my ukulele and I got whatever light I'm deciding to use. I'm gonna sit down. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna put in some headphones and put on the 120 for the uke you're playing, the uke part you're doing. So let's say you're doing uke two. This is gonna be on your headphones. And that's gonna be on your headphones so that you can hear it. You can have your music in front of you just make sure it's not like this <laughs> where your music is blocking so much of the camera okay have the music off to the side or even if it's in like a little part of the frame we we will most likely use squares of everyone so if you can give us a nice square of you then that's something we can really use i'm skeptical of this speed hmm. should we do 100 let me know if we should do 100. If I get 10 of you to say yes, let's do 100 BPM, then we'll do 100 BPM. That did feel really fast right now when I tried playing along with it too, even for me. So, I'm thinking 100. All right, Susan says 100. Seven more. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, 150. Hi. Okay, let's do 100 BPM. So, right now is recording day. I'm gonna tune. I'm gonna check the tuning again. I'm gonna put 100 BPM on the uke part I'm doing. I'm gonna be ready. the recording we don't want to hear that that's why we need it on headphones do you have to hide the headphones no your headphones can be big clunky and showing but we don't want to hear the recording we want to hear you so just to review you set up your phone camera whatever you're using make sure that you have nice light whether artificial or um or natural we don't have to see the whole uke. We want to see more of you, if possible. Then I go like that, you might get a little bit of both. I just have a five head, so that's why my forehead just really shows. Let's practice it again Wednesday, Monday. And then let's start recording like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Start sending in your videos. Um, let's, do, let's do a week. So by the end of the month, how does that sound? That'll be by the end of the month. Uh, we're in May, right? January, February, March, April, May. So May has 30, 31 days, 35, 31 days. So um, by the end of May, let's, let's, uh, let's have all of those recordings in to bernadetteachesmusic at gmail.com. So the name of the channel at gmail.com. So, um, the most important thing is just you participating in it. 
Um, my recommendation: don't stop the recording every time. Don't stop the recording every time you make a mistake. Just do the whole thing. Do your first video. Just do a whole recording. After that, if you want to stop anytime you make a mistake, then sure. But get one good video because, uh, look, this is coming from someone who's made thousands of videos now. There's no perfect recording. You're not gonna get one where you're gonna be satisfied. Really, 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 I'm sorry. It just doesn't happen that way. Um, you're gonna get, you're gonna hear mistakes that even Prof and I are not gonna hear. Just, you are gonna be way harder on yourself than even we would be. Something that we would be like, oh, it's perfect, I didn't even notice. You're gonna hear um, that. Uh, Akansha, Akansha, hi. We're gonna make a recording together of Lion Sleeps tonight. And so, different people are gonna play different parts. On Monday, let's talk about who's doing part one and part two. And I see there's part three. So, Prophet, did you send me more music for part three? Um, so, I prefer you just put the headphones on and play through and send that video. Maybe a second or third one, but just a full playthrough. And then Prof and I will use the parts that we need based on how many other videos we get. And then Prof and I will also be in the video. So, that way we make it as a fun little class project. We could have a blooper reel. There you go. That's a good way to use any mistakes. And uh, I can clap my hands in the rhythm. See, anything goes. Um, bonus points for, oh, what should we wear? We should wear something. Like, should we wear yellow, orange? <gasps> what do we wear like primary colors, like rainbow colors or something like that? What do you want to wear? Also make sure you're wearing pants in the video. Yes, please wear pants. It'll feel like a real class. Exactly. Great motivation. Yay. Do we have part three? Yeah, Prophet, do we have part three? Because I see there's a part three on the SoundCloud. Will someone sing? There doesn't need to be singing because we're doing chord melody. Rainbow sounds great. All right. Rainbow colors. So uh, wear red, orange, yellow, blue, violet, green. Um, I'm listening so badly to do this. Yay. Um, uke shaker, no uke shakers right now, because I don't know if that would line up nicely with the audio. However, if you wanted to record a separate video with a shaker, that would be nice. We could use that. Um, I am wearing uke merch. Wear uke merch. Anything that has lots of color. That way when... We put all, thank you, Ritika, I appreciate that. That way, when we put the video together, we have, um, we paint the screen. Bonus points if you've got a colorful uke, like Peg, I believe you have like a red one, right? So, colorful ukes, if you don't have colorful uke, Donald Trump. Hi, friend, I love you, we have gotten better thanks to you. You're welcome, Donald Trump. <laughs> So, you can try and play other instruments. I will try to make everything fit. If you do play other instruments, just make sure you record it on a separate video, okay? That way we have one video of you with ukulele, and if you do a shaker, or if you do like, you hold down keys on the piano, that would be really nice. Uh, or if there's like a, a local instrument to your region, or something native to your region, that would be really harshit. Harshit, you are more than welcome to join us. Uh, we have, <laughs> Trump left the chat. We have the sheet music down below for uh, anyone who would like to join. By the way, this is all with natural light that I'm using. Uh, let me show you how the light, it works here. Um, the former president approves of your channel, thank you. So we've got light bouncing off of the sidewalk over here, this, and it's, it's kind of a nice light. Can you please walk through once again exactly what we're supposed to do and where to access everything? Of course, Hershey, welcome. Okay, so there's sheet music down below for um, all of the songs that we've been learning recently. The last one on our printable, it's like a Google document, the link is down below. Um, the last one is The Lion Sleeps Tonight. 
there are different parts to it so you can choose the one you like best we also have links to our practice tracks and they sound something like this <laughs> tracks you're gonna practice your part so that you can be ready once you practice for a day or two grab headphones and using the practice track record yourself the reason why we want you to use headphones and use the practice track is so that we will all record using the same tempo marking that way I can take Sayara's video who's in India and I can take Kristen's video who's in Germany and because they both use the same audio track I'm gonna line them up, or Profe's gonna line them up, and they're gonna sound like they were listening to each other. Um, so we will start recording. Actually, if you're ready to record, record yourself and email it to me. Thank you, I believe that was Kiara. Yes. The email is Bernadette Teaches Music, like the channel name, at gmail.com. Send your recording there. Should we count to four before we start or something? The practice audio track has four clicks. So we don't need you to count before, but I would love it if we had like 10 seconds of video before um, we before your playing starts. Because if there's 10 seconds of video, even if it's just you setting up or getting ready, or you hitting the play button on the practice track, that'll be nice because we can fade into the video and then it starts. It's not like it starts right on the first note, you know, like video opens it. Dun, dun, dun. It's too much. But if it fades in and then it starts, dun, 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 then it'll be really nice. At the end, also leave like 10 seconds of video. So after you finish freeze, let your last note fade and do like a bye or like a or whatever you would like to do. Um, but give us a few seconds there at the end. Because if we do, uh, this is the ending. And video's over. It's too abrupt. But if you end it, and then fade it'll look so nice okay if you just drum you just do f b flat and c throughout the entire song yes so if you're gonna just drum listen to the recording to run to the restroom and I don't want to end the life so I'll be right back be good class I'll be right back I'm back. It's just that I committed myself to drink more water, which means I have to go to the restroom more. Okay. Ask me questions about recording your video. The best thing would be to see your face. If we get ukulele in there too, um, all you have to do for that is just back up a little bit and we get more instrument. That's it. I'm afraid. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Um, what else? Wear bright colorful colors. 
if you have jungle themed stuffed animals bring those in i think my daughter has a little giraffe so i might bring that in since it matches the theme of lion sleeps tonight all the animals that were in oh i think i have a little lion maybe i'll make the little lion do a little dancing um have fun with it do we just choose a random part should we send in both hmm. actually yakshanka it would not hurt to send in both if you're confident and you like and you'd like to do that it would be nice uh to have both a tip from a pro but put a little light in the background yes so let me te show you what i do for lighting just in case any of you are bougie and can do fancy lighting or fancier lighting um or this is something you'd like to do more of like you want to record yourself you want to make videos you want to make a youtube channel okay so i use these two box lights and i use this umbrella light behind me because the little tip from the pro is right having a little light behind you just adds this little like touch of i don't know what it is but I can't explain it. Maybe Mr. Pro can explain it. So, let me turn on one light at a time. That's the little back light. That's my side light. Let's look at how that looks. Already better. And that's the front light. And that looks pretty cool. You can mess around with your angles. So some people don't like like uh, shadows on the face because it makes like wrinkles kind of pop. Uh, in my family, we have this. Um, ah, I touched my eye and I had soapy hands. <laughs> in my family, this kind of runs in the family, and it looks like. Um, bags like it looks like we haven't rested but it's just like this sunken eye that we have that runs in the family and I guess I have been really self-conscious about it in the past so the way that I um, kind of work with that is I just do very balanced lighting from both sides and that helps pants squad what are we gonna name our orchestra brought to you by the pants <laughs> But to you by Euglandia. Bernard, do you have any flight collaborations? Flight collaborations? Like uh, collaborations with uh, with flight, you mean? Yeah, I made a ukulele with them a long time ago. I'm writing all the details down on Telegram. Thank you, Kiara. I will probably copy paste that into the description box of this video. Fancy pants squad. Oh, that's cute. Pantsy. Oh, I like Plazzy. Uh, yes, Donald, I did one like two years ago. I may have been their first collab, actually. Hmm. Yeah. Um, I think that answers everything. However, if you have questions while you're recording, and Kiara is a treasure, treasure let's drop some black hearts for Kiara. Pants Orchestra sounds amazing. Everything with pants. Um, pandemic oh i like that the pandemic <laughs> it's funny is my chat visible yes we think we can see you did you ask something i don't know if we ignored uh, or missed the message we didn't ignore we missed the message maybe that you wrote pants are us oh my goodness what if we just change our name for every little collab we do and everyone's gonna be like who are these people we just like your purple pants thank you Sandy Davis, are you related to Gareth and David? Backstreet pants, all right. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> you are making me very hyper. Pandemic is awesome. I yeah okay so that's another vote for pandemic. Pants a world. I'm gonna put this up here because my veins are driving me crazy. But I feel like I look like the lion from Wizard of Oz with this thing. <laughs> That wasn't getting sent for some reason. Now it's working. Okay, spice pants. Oh my god. Who's panting now? Pandemic is good. Ritika la females. <laughs> Don't I look like the lion from Wizard of Oz? Like, come on. Maybe this is what I should wear for the lion sleeves tonight. 
A Pan Zeppelin of Kristen. <laughs> Pants 182. <clears throat> and thank you, Killjoy. <laughs> you all are mean. Yes, do it. No. I feel like fantastic. Ooh, fantastic is good. <laughs> Okay, so Kristen, let's play the game Kristen's playing right now, right now. Kristen is taking Aaron just jumped in any um band name and replacing one of the words with pants. So the Pantastics, uh, red hot chili pants, <laughs> pant dukes. <clears throat> So I said pants 182. Does anyone have any experience sending that long of an email through a uh, video through email? Um, usually Gmail will let you do it. It'll put it in the drive. Pants day, pants Floyd, beetle pants, uh -huh, the pantles. I thought that said panties. My chemical pants. I love that. Pink pantsers. Oh, pants with mag. The rolling pants. <laughs> Follow pants, pants at the disco, pants, the talking pants, the big pant theory, pants against the machine, pants against the washing machine. <laughs> oh my gosh, Jennifer Paniston. <laughs> Imagine pants. Oh my gosh, Pantsalica. These are such good names. We have the best like emoji called pants. So glad we don't have to use potatoes. A pants to remember. <laughs> Hi, Alyssa. Alyssa, you should write an arrangement for us to play too. We're playing an arrange. We're gonna make a video of playing an arrangement um, made by Profe. But if you all want to expand on chord melody, are we Alyssa who just uh, commented here? What was it? A pants to remember has a channel dedicated to chord melody. The rolling pants, pants and roses. Ooh, pants and roses. I love that. Pearl pants and pants jam. Yuku pants. Pantaroon five. Oh, three third eye pants. The pink pantas. Oh, that's clever. Pantera. You don't even have to change the name. John Sebastian pants. Johan, nine inch pants, <laughs> nine inch pants, <laughs> oh my goodness, so, this is so funny, <laughs> or e pants, <laughs> I think pants, destiny's pants, joining the live now they must be so confused street pants didn't understand what you asked me to arrange but you can message me privately if you like <laughs> okay pants green pretty pants pretty pants what's that from pretty pretty pants what's that one from me pants string key pants oh my goodness so what are we gonna choose popcorn and pants um, oh, pretty woman, gotcha. Pretty in pants. Pretty in, <laughs> pretty in pants. Oh. What's worse than having ants in your pants? Uncles? What? Having uncles in your pants? <laughs> Deaf pants. Oh, gosh. Oh, you guys got it. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Pants day, pants supply. Pants supply sounds like a warehouse. 
But he goes on death pants. <laughs> so what's what's gonna be our name? Bare naked. <laughs> Well, I was going to record after this, but I'm pretty sure I uh, almost cried my makeup off. Uh, Lincoln pants. Pants color. Oh. County pants. Back straight pants. <clears throat> Alrighty, y'all. Well, on that note, uh, let's uh, think about it. Think about it over over the weekend. AC Pantsy and see which one <laughs> which one you want to be our band name or maybe we'll just have 50 different band names they all have pants I guess so <laughs> Kristen you got me <laughs> Bruno Pants <laughs> let's talk about it on the telegram and uh we sh we'll decide there. If you're ready to send in your video, we're using 100 BPM. Send it to Bernadette Teaches Music. And uh, we'll, we will start merging and editing. You made me cry. Next time, song with pants. Yes. Yes. Wear, oh, wear a game of pants. Dun, 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 dun. Remember to wear pants for your video. We're trying to do rainbow colors. So if you have rainbow colors, wear them. If you don't, then still, of course, participate. Maybe if you don't have rainbow colors, maybe um, a black will look really sleek and cool or white. So have fun with it. Don't, don't feel like you can't be in it because you can't do a whole song or because you don't have a rainbow color like number one priority is to get us everyone together number two priority is to have a quality video that we can use meaning that we can see you and we can hear you that's it and priority three is for it to be fun so the outfit and all that other stuff it's not as important definitely wear that bow i might i might wear it okay so have fun with it it would be so cool if you look like a crayon, meaning that like you wear a whole color. So if you can do that, I think I might wear all red and just wear this bow. So I might wear all red everything. And I think I have a red uke. So I'll, I'll do that. Have fun with it. Have fun, have fun, have fun. Don't worry if your camera quality is not the best. Use what you have, okay? Everyone has to wear a red bow. So, um, priority number one is just that we're doing this together. Okay, I'm going to head out of here and I'm going to change the images on the SoundCloud so that it has the Lion Sleeps Tonight thumbnail, like the image. And then, oh, there's a song I'd like to, <laughs> you look like a fire extinguisher. All red, huh? There's a song tutorial I want to record today. So, Slovakia, hi. <laughs> so, have fun with it. If you have a little jungle animal, stuffed animals, or animals in your home, uh, use them in the video as much as possible. If you want to send a separate video of you making your cat dance, please do so. We would love that. Um, it'd be so fun to include our pets in the video. So, if you have a pet, like Sayada has a beautiful bird, so yeah, if you can send a video, even if it's a short 15 second video of your bird, like dancing or doing anything like that, like send it in. We would love to see um, Aaron Carr. I'll bring my parent. Yes, bring in your pets to the video and we'll bring it. We'll include them somehow. Have fun with it. Have fun. Be as creative with it. Imagine that this is going to be used uh, as something we'll watch years to come, you know, like of something fun that we did together yes pet lizards any pets that you can include or if they can be with you on the recording of the video and thank you profe please use all righty everybody let's head out thank you so much for everything today thank you for those super chats i'll send to profe i don't remember exactly how much it was so someone let me know on telegram 
And uh, thank you, Prophet, for making this arrangement for us and for helping us out. And uh, Les Paul RK, hi. All right, take care, and I'll catch you on Monday. Come back for a tutorial tomorrow. Ciao, ciao. And I'll see you Saturday, Saturday at the Play Along Festival. Love you. Bye.